this is the Fujitsu or O General Inverter Mini Split Air Conditioner, which I have installed in my workshop. It is working right now, but the customer complained that it worked for 30 minutes and then stopped afterward. I asked the customer if you checked the light blinking on the indoor unit display. The indoor blower motor is working. The green light on the display, which is the operation light of the air conditioner, is working. The customer didn't notice the blinking of the air conditioner, and he sent the complete unit to me. But the unit is showing some other problem here. This air conditioner works for 15 minutes, then stops for 1 to 2 minutes, and then again start to work, but stop after 15 minutes again. It is now the fifth time that the air conditioner started and stopped. See, it has started to work again. The refrigerant pressure on the manifold gauge of the air conditioner is also fine. The pressure is almost 130 psi in working condition, and the compressor is at full speed. It is consuming 5.1 amperes right now, the compressor will speed up further. It will almost consuming 6.4 amperes, the maximum. I will trace the reason why it is stopping after 15 minutes. I tested the air conditioner by removing the plug, and then it stopped after 30 minutes. The best way to trace its fault is to let it work so that it may show a light blink error on its display. Then, it will be easier for me to repair it. It has now started to consume the maximum amount of amperes, which is 6.5 amperes. The compressor is working in full RPM. The return pipe of this air conditioner is cooling immensely well. The discharge line is also working fine. It seems to have no issue with it. The pressure of the refrigerant is 135 psi. We will have to wait until the error is not displayed on the indoor unit. The error has started to show on the display of the air conditioner. I will move its cover upward. Let's see what is the combination of the blinks. I have counted the blinks. The operation light is blinking 9 times. The timer is also blinking 9 times. And the economy light is blinking continuously. Now, I will check what the company says about this error code. This combination of the error code on this Fujitsu air conditioner means that the 4-way valve is faulty. Other than this, two more options are given about this error code. But let me tell you the most interesting thing. You can see this is the model number of the indoor unit. And let me show you its outdoor model as well. This is its outdoor model number. The interesting thing is that this is a cool model only. It has no heating or reverse valve. The error the indoor unit is showing is, in reality, not its actual problem. So, how will we trace the problem? Let me explain to you in two ways. The first is that it works for 15 minutes and then stops. Why is it doing that? See I have installed it in my workshop which is an open area. The room is quite big. And as I have installed it here for testing, the unit is under capacity according to the room. When this unit starts, the temperature of the sensor should go down. If its temperature does not go down, then the air conditioner will go on and off again and again. The circuit board will think that the air conditioner is not cooling because the sensor's temperature is not changing, which means it is working normally. Now the fault which the customer told me is that it stops after 30 minutes. I will install this air conditioner in a room, then, test it to see how it functions. But I don't have a small room to install it for testing, because the rooms are big in my workplace. It will show the problem here. So I have decided to send this air conditioner back to the customer and let the air conditioner be installed in the customer's room. Let me give you some hints about what could be possibly bad in this air conditioner. This is what I think, but it is not confirmed. I have checked the sensors of this outdoor unit. The values and readings of these sensors are absolutely fine. But any of the sensors between these three could be bad when the air conditioner runs. Mostly the condenser or the compressor temperature sensors. So I will have to wait to find its fault. If the customer complains to us, then I will film a video of it and share what the actual problem this unit had. Click on the left or right thumbnail to watch the next videos and subscribe. Thank you.